Virginia Hill with your Doppler 10 weather forecast. Happy Friday, South Texas. While well, a massive northern lights display lit up the sky over the Arctic Circle Wednesday night, the spectacular fast moving auroras could be seen filling up the sky above the northern Finland just before midnight. And according to a local northern lights photographer, these were the best auroras he's seen since September 2017. The bright white, green and even pink auroras were clearly visible even to the naked eye. Northern lights, also known as Aurora Borealis, are a result of collisions between electrically charged particles from the sun that enter the Earth's atmosphere. So pretty interesting stuff right there. But here in South Texas yesterday, we saw some gray skies and even a little bit of rain. But on this Friday, massive improvement. We're seeing sunshine here in the coastal bend. A few sprinkles up by Houston, but down here in South Texas, no rain on the radar, just sunny skies and warm temperatures. Well, how warm were they today exactly? Well, most of us were in the 80s, some of us even creeping into the 90s today. Here in Corpus Christi, 85 degrees was our high 86 in Orange Grove, 90 in Alice and 92 degrees in foul furious and here in the state of Texas seeing some of the warmest temperatures across the country. Many of our friends up north still seeing current temperatures in the 50s, 40s and even 30s. So what we're seeing down here in South Texas definitely unusual for some of our friends up north. But right now in downtown Corpus Christi, very nice. It is warm. We're seeing at 82 degrees humidity higher than it has been these last few days. We are seeing some windy conditions currently blowing on the southeast at 20 miles per hour and partly cloudy skies. Let's go and take a live look at shoreline and isn't it beautiful? Plenty of sunshine, warm temperatures, actually a beautiful day for hitting the beach, especially if you're on spring break. But taking a look at tonight, temperatures tonight will also be significantly warmer. It's going to be humid and mild with patchy fog. We're going to see a low of 68 degrees tonight and the winds will be light still blowing at the south, only up to about 10 miles per hour. And tomorrow, good news if you have plans on Saturday. It's going to be another beautiful day, mostly cloudy and warmer. Expect a high of 84 degrees for tomorrow. And the winds will be at the south, southeast, only blowing up to about 15 miles per hour. Definitely looking forward to tomorrow. Well, now it's time for your seven day forecast made possible by our friends at AutoNation. AutoNation has a huge haul of trucks and SUVs all on sale right now. Visit their website. It's AutoNation.com. Now taking a look at the seven day forecast, Forecast. Tomorrow, mostly cloudy, isolated showers in the forecast, especially for the northeast part of our viewing area. Kind of the same thing on Sunday, even warmer. But Monday, believe it or not, our next front will be rolling in and behind it, even better weather for the first day of spring on Tuesday. Beautiful sunny skies, highs in the 70s for Wednesday, warming up on Thursday, partly cloudy and windy next Friday. Well, that's all the time for me in the forecast. Andy, back to you. All right, so